to my channel. Um, a huge thank you to everybody who is liking, commenting, subscribing. Um, and anyone that is new to my channel, um, hello. If you haven't liked, comment, subscribe, then please do subscribe and it'll kind of keep you in touch. If you press the little bell as well, it'll kind of tell you when all my unboxing videos are. I do some tutorials and product tests as well. Um, today's video is an unboxing um, and I subscribe to a, another box um, but I had a discount code and I thought I would give it a go. So um, I've never heard of this before, it is called a wow box and I've seen like the, is it the, I can't even say it, is it the Degusta box or Gusta box, I've seen that one um, and quite a few people on unbox it i came across this on facebook i want to say it kind of got my attention there and i had a little look at it and there was a discount code um and it was basically um subscribe for three months and get the first one free so um for three months subscription it cost me like 19 pound 13 um i did have to pay for postage and packaging which is 11.97 i think in total and that was for the three months so it's like three, four, ninety-five, something daft like that for postage and packaging. Um, and it's uh, the Wow Box is a snack and drink subscription. Um, so I thought I'd try three months and kind of see how it is. It's something different, something that I haven't used before. I do particularly tend to stick with beauty. Um, so I thought I would have a little crack at it. Um, and I'm like I say, I've not seen anyone unboxing anything of these. But this is how it came. It came with it with Yodel, I think, delivered it. Um, and it's huge. Um, you kind of get a little, you can subscribe. I think, um, I haven't had a proper look at my page. I know I couldn't really do anything with this box that came, so I don't know what's in it. Um, but I think you can kind of customise a little bit and you can add, pay extra to add things to try. And I chose um, an alcoholic box because um, you get three beer and wine and stuff in it rather than the non-alcoholic box but you get the option of two um, and this one I think you get between eight to ten products um, and again I think same with the other box um, I don't know if you get a little bit less with the alcohol box because they put alcohol in it so it probably costs more I don't know um, but yeah so completely new to me never unboxed never seen anything about it and um, have no idea um, and like I say, I probably need to have a bit more look at the web, my website um, to kind of see what it entails. So, uh, open it. You think, doing an unboxing channel, you would be um, better at actually unboxing. But as you're more than aware now, I'm useless. Oh. Ah, we're in. Okay. Ooh. So you get a little piece of paper, um, wow box me it's called. So surprise products, so it gives you kind of a little list um, of what's in there, but it doesn't give you any more information um, and it's not got a, if I show you that so this is the outer pack and there's no like wow box or anything this is the box um which is fine okay so i have got a thomas tucker classic popcorn sweet and salty 90 calories per serving it's 80 grams oh they must have known me i love popcorn i can't tell you how much i love popcorn like if I open this without the kids, the kids won't get a look at it. And if I open it with the kids, then I have to portion it out beforehand because I'm one of the people that can eat a whole pop box of popcorn before the film has even started. So yeah, I'm really happy. I've not tried this one before. Thomas Tucker made in the UK. 80 grams, sweet and salted. Yep, really happy with that one. Um... got a maggie now i've seen them they do like shake and bake stuff i've used a couple of their um like they come um 
so you kind of tear it open and it's got a bag and the seasoning in it. I've used some of their stuff before. I didn't know they did like snack pots though. Fusion Authentic Asian Noodles Spiced Curry with two sachets full of authentic flavour. 25% less salt, no artificial colours, stuff to love, turmeric, spices, cinnamon, wheat flour. Calorie wise, um, 308 calories in this, I'm guessing that's in this pot. Um, just add, add the seasoning and veggies to the cup, pour the water to the line cover and wait for four minutes. Um, I think my husband will probably try them out, I may have a spoonful but he quite likes the little pots mm. so I've got an energy why is it an energy drink I've got a drink I've never heard of that Caraboa energy drink green apple sugar free now, I like green apple but I don't know if I like energy drinks I like the Mountain Dew actually um, I don't like like the stuff they stick with your in Jaeger bombs I don't like that that smells funny and then so apple though I really like carbonated energy drink with caffeine again I think Pete might try that I'll have a sip instant win every 90 minutes Cara C-A-R-A -A, Boa Cup Cara Boa Cup never heard of him so yeah it's got four calories, no fat, no saturates, no sugar. And it's got 5% salt for recommended intake. God knows what it's made up of then. Um, is that another drink? Mitch, oh, I'm terrible with my pronunciations. So it's a Michelob Ultra Superior Light Beer, only 79 calories, crisp, clean taste. Now I, I do like a beer every now and again, I must admit, I'm, I'm a lager, not a um, bitter drinker. So, um, and I've never tried this, so it is something that I would try. It's three and a half percent volume, so it's not too strong, um, 355 mil. Yeah, I'm, I'm quite happy to try that one. Um, I do think I have a lot of drinks. We've got a lot of box full of these, like, I call them noodle things. I hate them. I'm perspiring things. We want to do with all them. Right. We'll have another drink. Today is all about drinks. So... Pomegranate and blueberry flavour. Oh, this is mine. So give your body a spritz of selenium to help keep you healthy. Sweetened with purify, purified stevia leaf extract. Calorie free sweetness from a natural source. 20 calories per 500 ml. Flavoured water. I do like um, pomegranate. And I like blueberry and I like the flavoured water. So I'm really kind of happy with that. And I've not tried this before. I don't actually know what the brand is. Um, so vitamin waters with C, vitamin C, E, S, E and Z, N. So yeah, I'm really happy with that. And again, I've not tried that. I'm going to take that to work with me today. Have a look. I still full of these horrible things. Oh, I've got one on the floor now. Okay. Oh, tea bags. I'm running out of them for work. Super Boost Blueberry and Raspberry. Oh, I'm really pleased with these. These are Tetley's tea bags. There's 20 of them. Super fruits. I do. Um, I say I'm trying to lose weight. I'm trying to. I'm trying to cut out um, the amount of tea and coffee I have because I have sugar in it. So um, I've been kind of going on to fruit tea. Um, but I don't like, I don't know if anyone knows, but green tea is like uh, piss it's horrid 
and it doesn't matter what you try and flavor it with i've tried caramel i mean caramel is lovely but caramel and green tea does not work fruit and green tea lemon and green tea the problem is the green tea for me so um i am a red berry kind of drinker um i do like an old gray tea as well but then i'm one of those heathens that put milk in it so um, i'm really happy with them i'm running low um uh, so they will come to work with me um, with bit vitamin vitamin b6 so yeah happy and i've not tried their ones now is that everything oh no Okay, so I have a lightly sparkling fruit wine, a cherry lambrini. I mean, I've not drank that since I was a kid. I like cherry flavoured. 5% 75 CL. Yeah, don't know about that one. I might open it to try it. I've not tried a cherry flavoured one. Um, Like I say, I've not drank that since I was like teenager-ish maybe maybe it's coming back in but i don't know i used to drink this and then go out that's when we were wandering around the streets because we were too young to get into pubs but yeah thankfully i have a friend who was like had a full beard at 14 so he i mean we didn't stay on this long because then he could go and buy vodka from the local shop so which i'm not condoning anyone to do and especially now my mum, I'm like, oh my God, please don't do that. Which they're not old enough to yet, thank God. Um, but yeah, I haven't tried cherry. I'll open it to see what it's like. So I think that was it. What we're left with now is all these things. I don't know what I'm going to do with all them. So we should have the beer. Yes. The Lambrini, yeah, that's two. New Maggie Frozen Tea, three. Noodles, four. New Twix White. I didn't unbox a Twix. Oh, I'm happy to have all these things about that. Well, there's no Twix. So my first box is missing it. Yep. Strobe water. Check. Apple. Yep. Popcorn. Check. I'm actually missing something, which is a bit crappy, really, because that's my first box. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Should have been eight with the Twix, and I'm guessing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. So my first wow box is a mix box. Um... I really like the popcorn, I like the water, the beer, the tea. We'll eat the noodles because Pete will eat that. The Lambrini's Catch-22, I'll try it because it's there. The drink I'm going to give to Pete. So there's, there is things that here, but yeah, I don't like the fact that I'm missing a product. Whether it is a little Twix or not. New white Twix. So, anyway. Month one done. Um, Overall... What would you give it out of 10? Maybe a 6. There was a lot of drinks in that. 1, 2, 3, 4. 5 drinks with the tea. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yeah. And then, of course, the eating ones should, is missing a Twix. So I'm giving this box a 6. Um, however, technically, this is my free box. So hopefully it steps up a gear for next one. I'm not. I may. Do I write them? I mean, how British are we? Do we write a strongly worded letter? The fact that you've missed my damn Twix. I mean, it is a Twix, so. It's not the end of the world. I've eaten a Twix before. And to be fair, I'm not overly keen on white chocolate. But if it's on the list, it should be there. But yeah, maybe a six out of ten. Um, and we'll see what the next other two boxes are. I don't know if anybody else is subscribed to this wow box. Um. 
or whether it's a relatively new thing i'm not sure because like i say i haven't seen it before and um, so if you've come across it before leave some comments um uh, and again don't forget like comment subscribe um and i'll see you very soon take care